Hello, students of Chinook High School. My name is Paul Sun Young Lee. I am an actor and a comedian and a writer. I play Appa on Kim's Convenience, Captain Carson Teva on The Mandalorian and The Book of Boba Fett, and soon to be General Iroh in the live action adaptation of Avatar The Last Airbender. And I am here today to share with you the Blackfoot word of the week. And I just got to let you know, I'm completely honored to, to have been asked to be part of this. Um, I think to maintain connection to and stay in touch with one's native language is very, very important. Um, I grew up uh, a child of immigrant parents. Um, my parents immigrated here when I was three months old from South Korea. And uh, as I grew up, I lost touch with my mother tongue. And it's something that when I was younger, I really didn't pay attention to. I thought, I, you know, I just didn't want to do that. But as I've gotten older, that is something that I deeply regret because um, I think it's very important to maintain that link to not only where you came from, but to where your parents came from and your ancestors came from. To know about your heritage makes you more of a rich individual, I believe. And really, um, I regret not being able to converse with my parents um, in a way that they can understand fully. And that would have been in their native language, which is Korean. So I deeply regret that. But... You know, things can change. You can still learn the language. I love this. I think take this opportunity and run with it because the more you know, the stronger you will be, honestly. So today's word that I've been given to convey to you is kakatotsi. Kakatotsi, which means star or mushroom. The word again is kakatotsi, which means star or mushroom. And here's a funny story. My English name, my Korean name is Son Hyung Lee or E Son Hyung. And when we came to Canada, it was, they, they gave me a name Paul. My parents chose the word Paul. Um, Paul, when you say it with a Korean accent, uh, we had a, a friend of the family mispronounce it and say Pyol, Pyol instead of Paul. Pyol in Korean means star. So there's that connection there. And I think this word, um, was very fitting, and I'm really, really happy to have gotten it. Again, that word is kakatotsi, which means star or mushroom. In any case, good luck with the rest of your learnings. Thank you so much for having me here. Okay, see you.